All right, guys, salute hoops. We are at Walmart, and as you can see, there is uh, absolutely nothing here. I was able to find one of these Bowman uh, University Blasters, and then I got some Prism draft picks. But uh, other than that, it's been looking pretty bare here ever since the new vendors took over. I don't even know who does this anymore, but as you can see, there's some soccer here, a little Prism, um, but not much else at all, unfortunately. So. Uh, this is actually my first time finding basketball here too in quite a while. If you guys watched any of the other videos uh, prior to the vendor change, this used to be pretty stocked, but it seems like times have changed. So this is looking like uh, COVID, middle of COVID uh, shelves here. Uh, minus that, of course, but uh, we're gonna try our luck with some Bowman and some NBA draft picks. So we'll see how this goes, guys. Salute to Hoops guys, welcome back to the channel. Another day, another video, another day in the sports card world. As you can see from the clip before this, uh, I took a trip to my local Walmart and uh, shelves are looking pretty bare. Uh, I don't know if anyone else is experiencing this. I was able to locate a couple boxes of basketball. We have some Bowman University and then some Prism draft picks. Uh, you guys know that I'm not really a fan of the draft picks at all. But, um, Needed something new for sure, and I was sick of ripping Donruss, so uh, we went with this stuff, and um, we're going to see how it is. The National is coming up, I believe, next week, so as things are starting to heat up in the hobby, uh, Prism, regular Prism, just dropped, at least the hobby did, uh, like a week ago or so, so I'm hoping that retail is coming up soon, uh, just because, like I said, it's been difficult to... Uh, get a hold of some new product and I'm sick of ripping Donruss for sure so um we're, we're gonna rip these I've never ripped the Bowman University stuff before there was one on the shelf and um as you can see also in that video the shelves are looking pretty bare I don't know if anyone else is experiencing that at their local Walmart but since the vendor change uh the shelves in my Walmart look uh pretty 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 terrible honestly so I don't know if that's, I actually don't even know who stocks them anymore really, but uh, if you were watching any of my videos before, you knew that it was, it used to be somewhat stocked. I mean, there was some stuff there, but there hasn't even, it doesn't even look like there's been a trace of like prism football there at all. So I'm guessing uh, it's either sitting in the back somewhere or it went out the back door. One of the two is uh, probably for, for certain, so. But we're going to go ahead and rip these guys. If you like the video, hit the like button for me, please. If you like what you see, hit the subscribe button. Uh, we are at 439 followers on the Slew Tubes channel. We're trying to reach that 500 mark by the end of the year. So hopefully uh, we can. And if you uh, would not mind hitting, hitting the subscribe button, I would greatly appreciate that. So we're going to go ahead and do the Prism Draft Picks first. Little blaster box here. These are super expensive, 35 bucks uh, for this stuff, which I wouldn't normally even touch, but I was in the mood to rip and we need some new product. So I've also been watching a lot of, <laughs> a lot of summer league basketball. Uh, so it's got me kind of in the mood for these new guys. So we'll see what we got here. We got Jalen Johnson, Chris Paul throwback, Sharif Cooper, and then Zaire Williams, instant impact. As with anything, we're hoping for like some sort of auto here. Damian Lillard, Trey Murphy the third, Rondo, and then we have a silver prism, David Johnson. I'm not too sure who that is. Kevin Love throwback, Davion Mitchell, Devin Booker. Then we have a green, Her green Herbert Jones. Definitely didn't know who Herbert Jones is and made a name for himself for already, so... We got Greg Brown, Luca Garza, Franz Wagner, and then Kate Cunningham Fireworks. Just seems like they're so late on this on these releases, honestly. I mean, these guys have already been in the league, so we got a purple pulsar back there. Carl Anthony Towns, Dayron Sharp, Clay Thompson, and a Sharif Cooper. Is that numbered? No. Pretty sweet card. Matt McClung, 
He's killing it in the summer league for sure. We got JJ Redick. And a Grant Hill Green. I don't know why this graphic sub just never does it for me, honestly. James Booknight. A little Paul George throwback. Andre Drummond. And then a green Aaron Henry. Uncertain who that is, too. All right, we'll put those there. And then kind of excited for the Bowman University stuff. If we can get it open here. There we go. A little damage to the box. Never hurt anyone. A little temperamental. And I believe like Chet Holmgren and stuff and all those guys are in here. So maybe we will, we will get lucky. We shall see. Hunter Dickinson, Ty Ty Washington, and Bo, Boo, Booey, I think is that. All right, we got a purple back there. Blake Wesley, Jaden Shackelford, Javier Wheeler, and Christian Lander first. All right. What else we got going on here? A silver action. Jared McCain. All right, we'll leave a silver for last. Max Christie, Kadari Richmond, and a Mikey Williams silver. Not bad, not bad. We'll take that. Got a something purple back here. Tamar Bates, Brad Davidson, Walker Kessler, David McCormick, and... Kendall Brown on the purple. I honestly wish Panini would lose their license because the Bowman card, like the Bowman Chrome cards from back in the day are pretty sweet, honestly. David Askew, Arthur Kaluma, Johnny Juzang, and then Tyler Beard. I believe Juzang is on the hometown Bucks here. Another purple. Chai Obaji, he's been doing his thing in Summer League. Jordan Riley, Tyrese Martin, EJ Liddell. All right, last pack, last pack. Bryce McGowans, Trevor Keels, Jared Roden, Javon Quinerly, Quinerly, and RJ Davis. Okay. Not too bad of looking cards, honestly. Wish they were all chrome, but these are kind of sweet looking. I like the purple. All right, cool. All right, not a bad rip, guys. Uh, just something short, sweet, and something new for you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, the Bowman, I believe it was like 20, 21 bucks. So kind of, if I'm not mistaken. So those are kind of right where they used to be as far as uh, blaster prices go. Uh, these 34 bucks for these these other blasts are kind of insane to me, but I hope you guys enjoyed the rip. And uh, looking forward to the national coming up. I don't think I'll be able to make it to all the way in uh, Atlantic City, but if you guys are going, uh, hopefully you guys have a good time. I went last year at the one in Chicago, which is a lot closer, and it was an amazing time. So if your guys are going, have an amazing, amazing time. Thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it. See you on the next one.